Okay, so this is actually something that I've wanted to do for a while. As you can kind of see the setting's a little bit different, but that's for the good reason. Um, I don't know if you can see that there is two things hanging right there, and that. Now, if you don't know what that is, that is considered a plice. It's something that you can use to kind of train for dry tooling and mixed climbing and ice climbing. Um, I've actually had this one built for, uh, I think, what, a year or two? So it's set up again. And I thought it'd be an interesting thing to do to kind of take you on a kind of journey for training for ice climbing and dry tooling. I have a lot of dry tooling aspirations for this summer. And I thought, you know, why not use the month of May to kind of do some training? So here we are, episode one of training for dry tooling. So what I'm gonna do is actually, it's gonna be a workout and it's gonna be three different things. And I think I'm gonna go and do it with four intervals. So what the workout will consist of is doing five laps on the plice, probably going up to right around where the straps are. I could go higher, but I don't really want to do that right now. I just haven't had enough time on it again, so kind of fresh to getting back into that. So it'll be five laps up and down, and then we'll go on to those. And those are going to be for figure fours and figure nines. And then I'm thinking doing five figure fours and figure nines on each side, so each leg, so do it that way. And then we're gonna end it off by, we're gonna do a little run. I think it's only down and back off of this um, driveway. It's basically, I think a quarter of a mile. So we do that four times, we'll have ran about a mile, and then we'll have done a bunch of laps on here and on there. And as the series kind of goes on, I might increase the amount of reps I do. And yeah, I think I'm also going to time it on my watch to let you know how long it's taking me to do the workout. So then after so long, um, I should be able to see some sort of progress and I'm hoping progress could be measured by how fast I'm getting it done. So with that being said, let's just kind of get into the workout and we're going. Oh God, I forgot how weird this is. I really haven't done it in a long time. Maybe I want to <laughs> the whole thing. You know, let's just do uh a slight introduction because holy cow, that is actually killing me. There we go. Oh. 
There you go. There we go. That's four. Yeah, I think I think I'll do half, half for the beginning, because four laps right now is almost killing me. Oh. Five laps on the place. Done. Now, figure fours and figure nines. Oh man, this workout's gonna suck. It's also the first time waiting these. So, if it all goes crashing, that's why. Oh gosh. are giving up so do one of my room left leg I think that's why. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> okay, figure nines. It's like this anticipation to it that you have to build yourself up. All right, figure nines. No falling on the ground. Yeah, two, one. <laughs> Figure nines are way easier. Holy cow. All right. Three. Oh, my arms are so tired. Oh. I'm gonna have to build up to this. Oh boy. Oh dear God. Oh. Oh. Now one more. You want my left. You don't get elbow break. section done figure fours and figure nines oh. yeah my my original goals might be a little bit too ambitious 
first day test ground can't do that long end up being a half mile instead of a full mile but I'm fine with that so now we're on the running section got bear spray in hand got microphone on me we're gonna be talking because there might be bears all right let's go give example and how tired I am after that little thing I'm not even switching into my running shoes I am doing this in my approach shoes very very tired forearms hurt hands hurt sucks. But it's fun. Very fun. Now if you can guess why I'm running, it's just due to a thought. Keep it going. So then this workout's more like a endurance. It's an endurance push. Because I'm not really looking at for strength training, more pure endurance. So I think doing the running and everything else will definitely help for my overall endurance. I'm tired. Okay, so workout's done for what I can do today. Obviously, since the beginning, I was a little bit ambitious. I didn't actually know how long it would take or how hard it would be. It turned out to be a lot harder than I was expecting, but that's good because that means I have a lot of area or a lot of ways to be improved with it. So in total, I did 10 laps on the flies and then I did end up doing uh, five, five figure fours on each leg and then five, uh, five figure nines on each leg twice. So that was a decent amount of time. In total, it took me 51 minutes in two seconds. I don't know if that'll pop up. So definitely have a lot to improve. I mean, that was just half of the workout of what I had planned. I mean, I originally had planned doing two more sets, but I think one of the areas I gotta work on is my hand strength. Uh, a couple times when I was doing the figure fours and figure nines and heck, even on the place, there just reaches a point where it's like, my hands just like wanna let go. So I don't really know if that's a, if that'll be like a finger strength thing or that's just overall hand strength. Um, it has been a while since I've done the place, so I could just be getting in the rhythm of that. And, you know, it's been about like a month since I really ice climbed because it's uh, ice climbing season's over for here. So, I don't know. But all in all, 
good workout. Definitely got to reconfigure it. Got to put in some rest time. The total endurance burner, but I had an idea. It works, but it works almost too fast. I'm dead tired. My arms are tired. Even, even running or jogging on the last one was tiring. So I'm going to go recover from this and look towards the next workout session. Hopefully I'll have some sort of metric to be better. Maybe I can go for three, three rounds rather than just two. So who knows, but thank you guys for watching this video. It's kind of a different one, but uh, hopefully you guys will follow along for this training series. With that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh. <laughs>